are heading off to our last event of the season with the main man Zebdee. We haven't been back to Bicton with Zeb since our fall. We don't do that well at Bicton. Nice and relaxed, lovely, sit lovely and relaxed, relax. He hasn't weed for five hours. How big it is as well. Look. Bigger than Ash. You give the dog a cuddle while I give you a cuddle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just gotta keep, keep looking hard. Don't look down because that's where you'll end up. <laughs> this week's vlog welcome back to my channel so today we are heading off to our last event of the season with the main man Zebedee it is a stay away event we are going to do the two star at Bicton we haven't been back to Bicton with Zeb since our fall so hopefully we can keep our nerves together um, it's not looking too raring to go at the minute but I'm sure he will when he uh, here we go oh god Oh, Wait, where do I go? Where do I go? Oh, God. <laughs> okay, that Scared is the me. horse that wants to go. He's feeling ready. The weather forecast was supposed to be horrendous. It's actually sunny now, so hopefully, fingers crossed, for a good weekend. Let's get on our way so we can get a coffee. <laughs> Scotty's now up front. We're in a world of trouble now, aren't we, Ash? Well, we've been in a world of trouble for hours. Traffic, 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 traffic. We're not getting there till seven and we left at 20 past two. We should have been there about 20 past five. Right. We've got trucker Caroline over here. Yeah, it has been very busy on the roads. So We're been... fed up. It's now going to be dark when we arrive. Tedious. Brilliant. A nice cheerful vlog for everyone. <laughs> Okay guys, I'd like to just take a moment to thank the wonderful sponsors of this video, Y Food. So before we head off to Bicton, it's been a very, very busy morning, getting everything ready, riding all of the horses, riding Zeb. So I've got my Y Food here with me. They are a full meal replacement. So I haven't had time to sit down, have my lunch. I've been on the go. So I've been sipping my classic choco flavor here. They have all the macro and micronutrients that you need, 20 for vitamins and minerals and they are so delicious love the choco flavor especially as we're heading into winter also love the salted caramel flavor but i haven't found a flavor i haven't liked i would highly recommend especially if you have such a busy hectic life like myself where you don't have time to sit down and you're on the go all of the time so i have a discount code for you guys ashley youtube that's going to get you 10 percent off really would recommend and we are now going to head off to bigton right we've arrived crew what's the time ash 7.33 And how long has it taken us to get here? Five hours, ten minutes Five hours, ten minutes but Caroline's just got it warmer It's it's 50 million degrees it's in here actually. Ashley's sweating It's so hot <laughs> It's not You too It's got to get warm before you've got to go out and do the stable You're not coming with us I've got to do dinner You're old and cold I'm old and cold and <laughs> I've got to do tea <laughs> We're here, there's Bubbles A.K.A. the bell A.K.A. the beauty and here, coming out of the darkness, is a steed. There he is. Ash, He's we're here. fed up. Yeah, we're all fed up. <sighs> right, we need to take the travel boots off and we've got to go, hello. Hello. Mwah. Got to go and um, get him checked by the vet. We might as well take our stuff for the stable so we don't have to walk all the way back up here. Yeah, okay. Into the darkness we go. Right, everyone. Well, Ashley's been just messing around with some sort of vet. No, me and the, to wait for the vet. Me and the bell have made okay, the bed. Do you want to have a look? look? Yeah. Do you want to see how Scott is done? Yeah. Three, two, one. Oh, oh, nice. Look at that. We've got bed here, tick, H2O, 
Tick. Nice. Feed. Tick. Why are you not more enthused? Nice. I've done it wrong. Very good. What? No. Is the bed all right? I've tried to disperse it the at the back. It's not bad. What do you mean, not bad? I'm going to bring it just out a bit because it's quite shallow. But no, I think it's, it's not shallow. Too it's deep, if pretty anything. Pretty good, good effort. I'll give you that. Jesus, I sometimes feel I get overlooked. Thank you very much. Appreciate right, it. Right, thank you. That's what I was water. after. Yeah, well done. Nice. All thank the best. You. Do you like it, Zeb? You don't care, do you? Okay, so I didn't realise we had to go all the way out. No. But that's not what I've seen on the yard. No. You always have to explain this to me because you've no. stumped me okay. there. You've mugged me right off. The only reason is because this was all muddy and it's quite a small stable, so I've just pulled it out a bit because otherwise you what didn't have much room to lie down. I've, I've lost interest. Yeah. Get him in. Okay. Right, watch this step. Watch the step. Brilliant. Yeah. Brilliant. He hasn't weed for five oh. hours. He doesn't like weaning the lorry, does he? Told you. No. That's you're in three, two, one. You're in. I don't want the hay net as well. Yeah, though. you like the hay net. I've done it in the corner as well. Yeah. Like so, he, so he's got a nice view there as well yeah. as out here. I'm only ever thinking about you and him, you know. So what's in there, Ash? That's got his chaw, mix, nuts, fibre beet and cool stomp. Okay. He has quite a lot. And he doesn't like us watching meat, so we're going to have to leave him. Okay, we're done now, are we? We're done Scott for now. Scott sorted you right out. Yeah. What do you mean, for now? We'll have to come back and change his rug. Ugh. What are you doing right I'm, now? I'm cooking. Taco Tuesday. <laughs> isn't it? But it's a Friday. It's a Friday. It should be for heater Friday. Done the horse's goes. bed. Tick. Cooked for the family. Tick. <laughs> I've done the back of the lorry. Tick. What have you done, Ash? I had to deal with the vet. All right. So what are you doing now? You've grated some cheese? I've grated some cheese, but we only have a small grater, so it's... I think that looks normal yeah. on there, actually. The dog's had a big tin of dog's dog food. A... We're back. We're back. We've got a light there, a little camper's light. Yeah, we've got a cool light. We've got this to put on the door in a minute. What's that? Stable guard. So while we're here, we can just do this, because we've got to change his rug, just put his bandages on. Is he happy? He looks quite content. Yeah. Quite. Sorry, buddy. We should have put in the carrots. Yeah. Aren't we sad now? He wants the carrots. Spot. Really thinks I've got carrots, everybody. Also bought a second hay net. Yeah. Which I think I'm just going to tie up outside here. Sometimes he likes to eat the hay while he's looking out the door. Let's see if we can get in there on his nostril. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Steamed up the, the old girl. This is what we're doing now going to bandage his legs. Why? Because he's been used to living out overnight so he's been moving around. He's going to be stood in a little bit longer. I just like to bandage them just in case they fill a little bit from standing still but... I'm going to come back when this is all done in three, two, one. Oh, nice! He's all, all ready for bed. He's all pinked out. Yeah. Pink bandages. Oh snuggly. Yeah. Yeah in a black and pink rug. Okay so that's us. He's ready for bed. We're going to go and get ready for bed. We've got our dressage tomorrow. Show them across country on Sunday, so we will see you tomorrow morning. Good morning, guys. We are with Zebedee now. How are you, buddy? I think you've been hiding from the rain. Look, look what I've got for you. Look at this. There we go. Nice. Is that nice, is it? Hey. Hey, buddy. Take your bandages off. Ready to go for a hand walk and a hand graze. To explain what's just happened, you're platting Zeb. <laughs> I'm platting Zeb, he's turned around. And the boy has up. blown out the back end doing? right onto the mat. Oh my Lord. Harry's coming in a minute and that's his, that's his first job. You clean that up. What the hell is going on? You've blown on the mat. Steve's here. Dad. AKA yeah. Harry. Decent. Yeah. Did you clear up? Yeah, yeah. I cleared that up. Yeah. No one else would be bothered. Yeah. He's already curled on our mat. <laughs> Steve's come down on his own. He brought the rain with you, he's throwing it down. Now, well, it's always rains here. It's just the place is full of mud. That's standard procedure. Yeah. So we found a dog. Whose dog is that? Whose dog is that? Bella? Who is it? Oh, oh god, there's another, there's another one. 
these feral ants, where are these feral dogs coming from? At least the bells are having fun. Sniffing bums, making chums. Who foil on? I mean, We've it's got the old Kevin Bacon's. It's it's muddy, so by the time we get there, it'll all come off anyway. Yeah. So this is a pointless task, is what yeah. you're saying. Yeah. Here we are, out here in the rain. Looking at the instruction manual for the lorry. Yeah, as usual. Every time we've been out in this lorry, this is an Iveco. Every time we come out, the lights come on. Now we have a different light on. It's like Christmas when that dashboard lights yeah, up, isn't it? Number 32. <laughs> Classic 32. <laughs> Warning light, OBD. Yeah. Oh, do you just give that a rinse off, please? Oh yeah, that's got poo on it as well. More poo for Steve. Says so looking miserable now. He was up for it, but now the rain's come. Yeah. I'll get my stock on. Right, we're just getting him tacked up. Yeah, heads in the game. So I can then get on. I think yeah. so. Two star dressage today. Two star dressage today. Need to just look over my dressage test in a minute. Yeah. But fingers crossed. Harry, how do you reckon this is going to go today? Uh, which bit? <laughs> we're eventing again oh, in the rain. In the rain. Miserable. In the middle of the winter. Yeah. Well, it's like the winter, but it's been like the summer for ages. Yeah. Now it's like the winter. Yeah, again, if but you look... can get back onto the hall. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, you can say, look at the dog then. Yeah, look at the dog. That's <laughs> AKA Bubbles now. <laughs> right, we've got Ashley looking absolutely ridiculous in her coat. The horse has pooed on my mat, yeah. which is quite nice. So we can then tread it all in the lorry, which yeah. is nice. Zebedee himself there is just Zebedee. We don't do that well at Bicton. We don't, he doesn't really like the show jumping at Bicton, but I think the dressage, he's actually turned out some quite good results recently. I think he's got to sort of 20 and thought well maybe I do know what I'm doing it's taken him 20 years <laughs> overall I think he's got it yeah. this time yeah, All right. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking score wise and if we get sub 35 I'll be happy so yeah yeah I think sub 35 I'm I'm hoping for like 33 would be really nice yeah if it's sub 33, I'll give you a cuddle about that. Yeah, all right. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'll tell you what I will do if it's sub 33. What? I'll give the dog a cuddle. <laughs> you give the dog a cuddle while I give you a cuddle. Yeah, all right. <laughs> right, let's go. What are you doing now? You've got something up Zeb's bottom. He's taking his temperature. It, what's Zeb's normal temperature? Around 37. 37. Is someone going to give me a leg up? CA with a leg up. Yeah, well, I've just, I've been so weak. It's You've what? got it. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, that, well, there, well that. done. That was better than last time. Oh, smashed it. Better. Right, let's go. God, he's just on a mission. Okay, guys, just got on and Zeb for the dressage. It is terrible weather. But he is feeling absolutely amazing. He is literally on one. Just Please walking sure so far, so fingers crossed we can keep it together though, because I think he thinks he's going cross country. So anyway, I've got to put my gloves on, get there, warm up, and hopefully, fingers crossed for a good test. Lovely, sit lovely and relax, relax.
happy with that. Yeah, I'm very happy with that. That's probably the best I've seen him go for a long, long time. That's sub yeah, 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 we thought Pretty he was decent. going to be yeah. overexcited. You better get yourself organised for a cuddle in a minute. <laughs> I'm actually very excited oh, about yeah, that, yeah. yeah. <laughs> How's the dog? Well done. Pleased with that. Yeah. yeah very really good. Really nice, yeah. Oh, yeah. I think that's the best I've seen him go. The only thing you'll lose, Martin, is he's tightening himself. He's 20. Yeah, he's but 20. he's just, he's, he's not expressive. He was never loose in himself. No, no, he's, certainly he's not, not expressive be in his movements, right. but I thought that was properly yeah, yeah. accurate. The only annoying, uh, the yeah. last across the diagonal, yeah. he kind yeah. of broke. But I thought your extended it was just yeah. lovely. Really nice. Yeah. Yeah. Really nice. And I, and I, and I thought your rain back was absolutely bang on. Square, yeah, so start and yeah, stop know, and slow. Yeah, no, and it was lovely. slow as well. I don't practice in there. I practiced once yesterday. Good boy. Yeah. Good boy. Yeah. Scott needs going to end up with a cuddle in yeah, we'll Sub 35 for sure. Yeah, yeah we're warming up for a cuddle. Yeah, no, yeah. That's, that's sub 35. <laughs> that's <definitely. laughs> to go down there and then do the scores. Guess the old score. Okay, so for context, when I looked this morning, one person did have a 24. Yeah. So that is kind of marking them when I was at Cornbury, because Cornbury, I think no one got below like 28, 27, 28, 29. But I think that was a very good test. I'm going to go for 32. 32? And I'd be very happy with a 32. Okay, that's cuddle right. bound if that's 32. It's what? It's me and Steve having a cuddle if it's yeah. sub 30. So what do you think? Right, I think. 33.1. Harry? Uh, predictions here? 34.6. No, actually I'm gonna change that because it actually was a really good test. So I'm gonna go 33.1. 33.1. Yeah. I went 33.1. Did you? Yeah. Oh well, that's because we're gonna cover. <laughs> no, no, we're not no, gonna cover go, like that. No, uh, sub 30. No, let's go to, let's go 32.9. Because then that's just we're etching into a cuddle there. Right. Yeah. No, we're, un we're under 35. We're having a cuddle. Oh really? Yeah. <laughs> that's changed. I thought, I thought it was 33. If it's sub 33, I'll give you a cuddle. How about that? Yeah, all right. Predictions. What, what people said? Uh, no, I'm not going to tell you. No, oh. you use your own okay. brain. Okay. Well, good lens. Good lens. I'm yeah. going for 31.2. 31.2. Yeah, nice. I've, I've got everything. Uh, go oh, you're glowing in this light. 32. Oh, I went 32. Okay. Okay guys, just finished my dressage test and I was very, very, very pleased with him. I think he did the best he could. You know, he's not a dressage horse, never has been a dressage horse, never will be a dressage horse. You know, he's not going to contest the leaders, but what we have to do is if we can get just a good enough score, that means we're still in the running for the show jump cross country, happy days. We're going to have a coffee and then we've got to walk the cross country course. Very good boy. Carrots, yeah. He knows, he's nudging me, he knows there's carrots coming. Come on, he says. Hurry up with the carrots. I have to cut them now, Zeb, because your teeth aren't as good. Yeah, yeah, she has to cut them because you're old. Old and cold. That's what he's worked hard for. He loves a carrot, don't he? He does love a carrot. Look at that. Get him oh, to do that thing where he pulls... Zip. Oh. He's taking... Oh my God, how many are you taking out of my hat? Get him to do that thing where he pulls you to the side. Watch this. There you go. <laughs> Just give me that. Okay, everyone, scores are in. Are they? Are you sure you're looking um, all right? Yeah, no, no, I think I've... Definitely no. Ashley Harrison. Yeah, no, Ashley, yeah, no, that's right. Okay, so, so you said 33.1. Scotty said 32.9. You said... 32. You said... 31.3. So I said 32.5. Okay, we're all wrong. Yeah. The scores are... I think it's better than that. 34.3. Oh, 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 oh you your face. Yeah, yeah, you made it. Yeah. Oh, my God. Really good. I got a couple of nibbles on the old rod there. Oh, 34. That's a mean rod. You That's get it. rid of that. Was it sub 35 we're yeah, having a cuddle? We're no, 30. I think 35. Oh, I'm happy with that. Yeah, I'm yeah, right. Still, you still said 33.1, so you were closest, yeah, I think. Yeah, as usual. Yeah. yeah. Steve was <laughs> closest as usual. And I started with 34, didn't I? Oh, yeah. I actually started with 34. You know what? It is sub 35, so I should want the camera yeah. to carry pick up the dog. Yeah. We've got to pick up the dog and then we've got... Yeah, no, he had a dog. I couldn't like it. Oh, God. Oh, Bell is wondering what's going on. Oh, look at the girl. She's a good dog. Oh, she's adorable. Oh, my God. Absolutely a bought adorable. Yeah. 
Gotta give Arab a burp. Arab <laughs> <And a burp. laughs> And then we'll walk the course. We've got to yeah. grab a coffee. Or if you're Steve, Cafe Ole. Cafe O. <laughs> Okay, right guys, we're now here walking the cross country. Hey guys! The cross country course. We are the doing. The cross country course. We're the yellow numbers, so we're just walking past number one. It is a bit busy here at the minute because they're doing the 93 day. Number one, a nice uh, fence just to get you going, quite wide, uh, but not too big, so nice just to get you in the flow. Look how wide that one is. Quite big as well. It's like the size of you. Fence 4A to B, we've got this log to a skinny on a relatively forward straight line, but you've come round the corner. Quite a tight corner. Very tight corner, so it comes up on you very, very quickly. So you've just got to be ready, make sure your horse knows something's about to happen. Uh, she's just. Waiting, Harry's gone to the loo and the dog is just out. waiting. <laughs> yeah, she... <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. 6A2B, two skinny tables, reasonable size but a reasonable distance between them. Big and wide. Very big and wide. We're at fence seven, A to B. This big hedge brush to then that skinny triple brush. Yeah, look how big it is as well. Look, bigger than Ash. Number nine is this quite horrible skinny on a mound. It just looks like you're jumping into, into nowhere. It's not that nice. That is horrible, that one. That's the size of Ash. And it's at the top of a hill. Right, a frightener. Okay, coming round to this next one. AA, through the water, to B. We've got a three-parter here, a bit of a skinny, and then we've got a ditch. Yeah, A, ditch, B, the ditch. C. So jump it. You don't want to be that fast yeah. because these also are on frangible pins so they can knock and then you um, get 15 pounds. And what happens when you knock one of those? Points do not make prizes. 15 no. minus. This dog is just class because we've got no lead issues. Look, this yeah. literally this runs on that little loose lead. She's got a lovely tail, lovely face, <laughs> lovely personality. Basically, everything about her is lovely. Look at her. She is the dog of my dreams. <laughs> quite a cute jump look because they've made this look like a house which is identical to that one over there. Adorable. One, two, go! <laughs> okay, we're at this oh, really? trachana which trachana. is quite big, however it's a rider frightener. If you actually look at the level of that, it's not that big. Yeah. Just got to keep riding through it, trachana. keep looking up, don't look down because that's where you'll end up. <laughs> This one is V-Tasty. We've got 15A, which is quite a big table, and that is on a right angle to be there. Look at this. That's a corner. That's no, look how tight that is. This table is very wide as well, isn't yes. it? That one. Corner at 17 on the curve to 18. This straightforward log, we're not that close to the water. Um, through the water. Through the water and then up and out over that step. So as you come to that step, you don't want to have them too long. You want to get in a little bit deeper. Uh, we have just hugged that tree because apparently if you hug a tree it's good yeah. for your mental health. We're under the really lovely oak. Okay, so we finished the cross country. It's a turkey oak. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to do my debrief on my own without. No, all come of on. Them. 
What's wrong with you? You've got all bits out. We're just going to have to cut no, all of that out. We're, gonna, we we're giving people it. some info. Oh just God. pan into that tree, I'm Scott. Cut it all that's, out. A tur- that's a it's, Turkish that's oak. That's a Turkish oak. It's yeah. all going to be cut out. Then give us one fact about a Turkish oak. Oh. Uh, it's it's Turkish big. Yeah. Turkey, <laughs> Turkey as in chicken turkey. Yeah, right. <laughs> OK, so we finished okay, the cross-country course. So we finished the cross-country course now. That's annoying. And... Should I pinch him? We finished the cross-country no, let her do my brain. <laughs> and it's the cross country course, course walk. It's quite a tough, tough course. <laughs> it's a tough, tough two course. star. But do you think it's a tough two star? I think it's uh, there is tough tough areas, but overall, I think it's okay. Well, overall, um, it's, well, overall it's doable. It's doable. <laughs> You, you, can give you, you can give the cross country team two think? three. I actually think the course is very doable. The ground's actually drying out lovely. I think there's a couple of difficult cock bits on it. Yeah. The T-shaped difficult one on the back there, and probably yeah. number three. The rest of it, some combinations. You've got to pay some attention, but it's well within our grasp. Yeah. We just got it's up and down, down, so we've got to cut in places to try and keep the time up. Time will be our enemy. Yeah, it's up and down, and because it's rained a lot, so the ground is it is drying. So hopefully by tomorrow it will be better. Um, but we have had quite a lot of rain, so. Yeah. But I think yeah, it's it's a nice course. I do, I do think there are some questions, but fingers crossed. There's always questions. We can do it. There's lots of questions. questions. <laughs> I'm going to yeah. ask a couple of pertinent questions or some searching questions. <laughs> Anyway, we're quite happy with that, so over and out we're going to get some lunch. Back to this oak, so we have hugged it. You've got some info for us, have you, Karen? Yes, because yeah? Scott likes to take the mick out of me over hugging a tree. Yeah, go on. When you hug a tree, you release a hormone called oxytocin, known as the hormone of love and trust, which gives you that warm, fuzzy feeling. Oh, nice. So it's actually good for you. Okay. So when you get a chance, everyone. And what do you release when you hug Steve? <laughs> Bitterness. This is a hormone called is oxytocin. It? Oh yeah. And when I hug Scott, happens. anger yeah. comes out of me. <laughs> so that's what you get when you hug a tree. So you, there's a good reason to hug trees. <laughs> Also, is Isaac going because he's older, isn't he? Maybe he needs some glasses. And they're all 